What's up, fans? It's KP. I am styling here at the Amy's Gift Suite in Hollywood with our buddy Christopher Rich. How are you, Migo? It's good. Yeah. Brother, I'm good. Yeah, you know, I saw you coming a mile away, man. I know. You guys saw you checking out going, oh, crap, here we go. It seems as if you've always got something going on. Yeah, I've been doing all this charity work for 2010, and I made the commitment to stick with it for one year. So, right. four more months of it. I am jumping out and doing some guest star stuff. I, I had a recurring gig on Desperate House. Right, right. So, I go back and do that. And I just had like the best time. You're not gonna believe this, but so you know, Melissa Joan Hart, Sabrina, yeah, yeah. and Joey Lawrence from Blossom, right? <laughs> yeah. They're doing a new I saw show. Them, I saw the the promos for it. Okay, yeah, so yeah. they're doing this new show, and I get this call of, would I come play an ex-U.S. senator who's the uh, father of Melissa Joan Hart? And the script was just awesome, man. It was yeah. so good. Yeah, he's like a little bit of a slime bag. <laughs> and I thought, well, that, that that works. It was like being in the second year of a show. They've got it down. Uh, it was so much fun to do it. I think that show's going to be on a long time. And in fact, they, they premiered out of Blocks big. So Yeah, we, we saw that too. Uh, we saw a couple interviews uh, with the two of them. And, and, and at first it seemed a little quirky, and then you saw the two together, and you could kind of just saw there was a little chemistry Yeah, there. they've got it. They've got right? the spark. Yeah, it really fits. You know, I mean, who knew? ABC Family, have you seen their lineup? It's not like a bunch of Rocky and Bullwinkle cartoons. Right. They actually have some real shows, so it's... It was cool. It was very surprising. So now they're going to add a veteran like you as, as a, re a recurring vet, dad role. Add a vet in there, yeah. <laughs> An old man. Uh, they had, it's a good cast. they got good young kids. And, of course, Melissa and Joey have right, been doing right, this right. forever. Yeah. They are vets. They're yeah. pros. Really a pleasure. It was right. really a rocking pleasure. So uh, this this week is all about television, of course, with the Emmys. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm more than interested as to what you watch, right? Not, not like... You know who you, where your friends are Seriously, on what, but what? I, I will, and this is not oriented toward my friends at all. Right. Okay, we watch uh, a lot, and you always hear this. I obviously watch a lot of sports. I'm from Texas. I'm right, sick right. for it. We watch a lot of new stuff, but we also watch like a Nat Geo continually. We watch the History right. Channel a lot, and my wife and I, the beautiful Miss Ava, she's around right. here somewhere. But we love those historical things like the the Rome series and Deadwood and. We've been watching Pillars of the Earth. It does have a friend, Ian McShane, who's on it, right. so little props out to Ian. <laughs> uh, but let me tell you something. At the end of the day, when you can watch something that's incredibly entertaining and you're learning something, it's expanding your world, hey, man, there's no better entertainment than that. There's just nothing better. But we love stuff like that. I also watch the NBC comedy block. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, i got to watch The Office. Right, right, I gotta right. i got to watch Parks and Rec. You know, i got to... And they're going to do this new show, uh, what is it, uh, Outsource? Right. Outsource oh, yeah, yeah. coming up. I, I saw that. That was, like, so <laughs> yeah. much fun. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I'm dying to right, see yeah. that show. Well, I think we remember, you know, growing up, like, all those Jacques Cousteau specials back in the day. Dude, 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 right? we love those? Or, or uh, what's his name, uh, Perkins, right? Oh, Mutual, yeah. Oh, Mutual of Omaha. Yeah. Mutual John, of Omaha. John is going to get eaten by the, right. by, by the lion right now. That's right. 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 You right. know, when, right. and they were so stereotyped. So when you told somebody that you were watching that kind of stuff, right, that, I think that's a lot of what the viewing public thought that that was going to be, but but Discovery, you know, Nat Geo, uh, uh, Wild, all those different networks. Oh, oh, it's completely different. I mean, it's not like that. It's not some generic thing. Right. I mean, you know, and on uh, shows like uh, Frontline or Nature or Explorer. Right. I mean, they're looking at a lot of different things. This isn't just nature. You know, this could be like why the North Korean government uh, acts the way it acts. Right. There's stuff out there that's really fascinating. Yeah. You know, the human experience is incredible. Well, much like you, my friend, it's always good to catch up with you. Always good we'll to get, see we're you. We're looking brother. for you online. I'm, I'm, I'm going to throw stuff at the screen when I see oh, you. Hold on a second. Wait, move that away. No, they misspelled this. This should say, you are. Am I right? Oh, jeez. Uh, there's so. a foul. There's a foul. Set this boy up for the home run. <laughs> More to come with my buddy Christopher Rich here at the Emmys Get Sweet in Hollywood. I'm KP. This Later. Is, <laughs> this is CR. We are styling, stylinonline.com. More to come. We'll be in Speedos later. <laughs> no. Look, we all, we all love the, uh, you know, having a laugh or a little bit of entertainment, right? Or is it just they finally got what the viewing American public wants? Is, is it me? Or it's so what, on. So I'm t I, I don't remember the, the last event that, that we got together, but we... We'll be in Speedos later. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs>
What was that? The Highlander? The Empire Strikes Back. Doctor Who? Star Trek The Next Generation was my favorite. <laughs> Scooby-Doo? Well, at the moment, it would be True Blood. True Blood. True Blood. I have to say True Blood, too. She-Ra. Doctor Who? The Star Wars, Episode 4. Firefly, without a doubt. Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Joker, obviously. Family Guy. <laughs> Good choice.